All right, so I'm just gonna play with some squishies <laughs> or own box. I got them, I guess, too. Some of these aren't, um, are, we already had, and so aren't um, being unboxed. And these are Gujitsus. These particular ones are the x-ray kind. So, so these have kind of a clear gel and then bones. Ooh. The bones are hard plastic. Or well, one off hard plastic is, but they're kind of a harder plastic inside. And then, of course, they're very squishy. Now, one thing I will say is that having had this one a while, you can see he's got air bubbles in him. His arm is empty. But he's still fun. I like that he's a shark. This one is also bones. He's a much thicker gel. He has not gotten any um, any air pockets in him. He definitely is a lot harder. You can't really kind of bunch him up and squish him out. But yeah, so he's and they all eventually go back to their form. So we're gonna compare these two Gujitsus here with a couple of different ones. So we've got a couple of different brands and just items. We've got little mochis. I think this is a sheep. And this one's a little, 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 little bloody guy. I'm just gonna open this up. Hold on, maybe I shouldn't just rip it apart, but all right. So the shelling brand, um, the Arnido. Oops. The Super Solid Squish um, Gumdrops. So this one's purple. And you can see Super. Super squishy, but it's a very thick squish. Yeah, this one's another one made in China. That's the Nido brand. And actually, I don't have the packaging for it, but we got for Easter these little Nido chicks. And you can see that they have kind of the like, soft goo inside of them. Ooh. They have like a little whoopsies. Little Nido shells. And the nice thing about the chickies. They're a little bit different between them. This one's got more air in it than this one does. We can see that they're they're both kind of made of the same stuff. And their shells actually go together pretty well. So we're gonna have little baby mochis in there. Come on, baby mochis. We have a mama incubate you. You're too round. Okay, that's fine. My little chickies. All right, then we got two peeps. We got blue and pink. One bunny or lapine. feel any different? Let's see. Oh my goodness, it broke. Oh my goodness. I should have had something for it. But here we go. That's the inside of the pink one. <sighs> That'll be a little bit of fun cleaning that up later, huh? <laughs> well, no accounting for sturdiness. That is one thing that is a downside of basically any of the squishies, is that they will eventually break on you. 
and where it broke was on the seal. But, so, so it is. But interesting part of it was that that was not the noisier one. So I think maybe because it was fuller, maybe that's why it broke. A little sticky. We're gonna keep going. All right, so this was the the nom name brand peeps that broke. So Pinky did not survive. A lash arm shard. All right, next we got you just three and up the toy network squeezy fun for everyone. Angry squish cat, and then you can squeeze them. Right, and they come in different varieties, but you can see which one you got. It's not a surprise. This one is called Tom. And the fun thing is it kind of looks like he's in like a little crate. So, kind of cute. Now, immediately, I notice that his little coloring is kind of wearing off. So he's got the classic issues a lot of the squeezies have, which is that when the coloring is on him, the coloring does not stay with the squeezables. So here's his little seal bell. Love these tiny little toes. Um, you can feel that there's no squishy in his legs. It's just his body that's really got all the everything going on with it I feel like I'm gonna break another one now but oh he's so cute okay <laughs> all right the last one and hopefully not one I'm gonna break <laughs> is the glow in the dark squeeze ball this one is also, I think, Pluto card? No, this is the Toy Network. So, we've got the Toy Network brand for these two. What's the brand on this friend? Um, just whatever Peeps got going on. Kind of sad it broke, but. So, glow in the dark. Got an extra thick plug here. I'm a little scared to use it with my, my ring. It's supposed to glow in the dark. It certainly looks like it should. Alright. Let's try it out. Yeah, I think it's glowing pretty well. But yeah. So, glow in the dark squeezies. This one, most of them, like you have that white goo in it. But as far as the squeezability, so this one's a little more squishy than this one. I'd say it's probably about the same as the chicks. Oh, the blue one. <laughs> now I'm like worried I'm gonna break it too. Okay, let's not do too much. <laughs> but definitely less than this friend. And this guy is has less give than this one. Or this one's, the, I think, the hardest one of them. Of course, our mochi. Yeah, I mean, this is almost mochi squishy. So, but yeah. It's a bunch of squishies. Um, so far, I'm most impressed with the neato ones. Because I haven't broken those so far. And their little seal, I think, is well combined in it. Like, I don't feel like that's going to break. So this one, I'm not super confident in. This one looks pretty well incorporated. But as we can see, this one is not well incorporated. That one's coming out almost. And this one, is said, broke. It's the same deal. Got the little plugs just kind of in there. 
and it, it feels like a different texture almost so the rest of the body is very squishy but the seal is very thick so no wonder the seal itself isn't very good but okay. um the gujitsu are really clever they have the cap in the head is where they have the the bottle seal like i said with the little like liquidy gel ones air gets in there but all right well them's them squishies squish 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 happy playing thanks so much for listening to your great day